Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new My name is Alicia and today it is a Monday I just got back home from school and I'm currently getting ready because I'm going on this event with my work tonight So basically I have been very busy recently like I am involved in so many different stuff I feel like I think that I've already graduated like my brain is convinced that I'm graduated already So I'm just involving myself in all these different stuff without thinking about that I'm a full-time student so i have currently two jobs i am a student i am an ef ambassador so this week i have a lot of fun things happening but it's gonna be really busy but you guys are gonna get to follow along so i work at a amusement park in stockholm it's very popular and probably my favorite place in stockholm to be honest and it has just always been my favorite place so it's such a blessing to work there actually i just feel genuinely so lucky every single day that i can just go over there and have that as my workplace like this is literally going to be a memory for the rest of my life today we have a little event it's the end of summer season i'm gonna work there during halloween too but for the end of it they wanted to have a little event where you can nominate like the best people in different categories i wasn't nominated but i'm still going um and i'm gonna go and have dinner before that with my colleague that i have gotten really close to in a really short time so that's fun and we're just gonna eat italian and it's gonna be so nice but some other things that are happening is that it's my birthday on wednesday i have no plans except working <laughs> at my other job which is that i'm a dance teacher every wednesday for like 40 minutes and then on thursday till saturday i'm going to swim Switzerland. Um, I actually won a trip there with EF because I submitted the video that I did. I can link it over here. But yeah, I won that trip and I'm just gonna go on like an ambassador education trip. So it's not gonna be like sightseeing and then I'm just gonna work all day on Sunday. So yeah. <laughs> back home from the party and it is basically in the middle of the night and i have school tomorrow so i'm gonna have to sleep pretty soon the party was all right to be honest it was kind of a mess because we are over a thousand people working at this place so it was so crowded and if you lost somebody then you lost that person forever and that can happen to me it probably looks a lot more fun than it was i just felt really out of place and i don't know that many people yet obviously i've only worked like three shifts also, I just feel like I don't fit in at parties in general, like especially this one, it was so focused on just getting drunk and I just feel like it's very tragic that people can't have fun without it. But yeah, there are gonna be more of these parties in the future, so I hope that they will be more fun if I actually get to know more people. Hello everyone, so I just got out of the shower and as you can tell, I'm having a little self-care moment, a little quick glow up before my birthday. <laughs> I'm joking, but I'm sorry if you can't take me seriously looking like this. I understand that my final couple of hours as an 18 year old which feels kind of crazy like I know it's just about an age um, it's not that serious but still I like to think of my life in chapters and with every new year a new chapter begins so crazy that this one is closing now I just feel like I have learned so much and I am grateful for so many things in my life right now and I am in such a good spot as well so I'm just excited to see what the future holds for me <laughs> Sorella said 
Happy birthday to me. Thank you so much. It is such a nice day, obviously. It's always sunny on my birthday. It is actually not that cold and it's been raining this entire week. So I just love the weather right now because I can see the fall colors coming through and it just makes me so excited because I love fall and I obviously didn't really have a proper fall last year. So I'm just so excited and when the sun is out too, it makes everything so much more gorgeous. So it's like every airplane in the world wants to come right now anyway i just got back home from psychology we also went to this brunch place afterward that was just nearby our school and it was honestly so nice i never knew about that place but i'm definitely coming back more often like studying and stuff that would be so cozy yeah i've just had a good day so far now i am going to practice some of my dances that I need to teach tonight because as I said I have my dance class pretty soon In a couple of hours, we are heading to the airport to go to Switzerland. <laughs> this doesn't really feel real at all. When I submitted my video to this competition of winning this trip, I just wanted to see if it could win and it did. There was like over a hundred people participating in this and I was selected out of like 20 people to represent Sweden. There's only me and another Swedish girl that will be there. So yeah, that's kind of crazy. And it's also crazy that I know her from before we also went to poland together to fix our visas because the swedish embassy was closed so we had to go over there last year before our exchange year so we already know each other pretty well and it's gonna be so fun to travel with her anyway i am excited and you guys are gonna see what this trip is all about because i honestly have no clue in Switzerland and we are currently on a train that we are not sure if we're supposed to be in there. No, we have to figure this all out by ourselves. And we know exactly where we're going and exactly what we're doing. <laughs> and we haven't ate dinner yet, but everyone no. at the office has. Yeah, they're currently having a pizza night without us because they decided to book us on the last flight and on the first one on Saturday. So Yeah, so we'll be the last ones arriving and the first ones leaving. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't start better. <laughs> this is my roomie. Hello, I'm Tabea. Where are you from? Germany, and I was in Washington State. <laughs> It's very cold and I'm locked out of my room <laughs> It is really cold and your blog person is super nice Oh, you're, you're recording it <laughs> They 
two. Day two. <laughs> now we're on the way to the EF office from our hotels. And it's yes. 8 in the morning. And we got to bed really late yesterday. So we're a bit tired. But <laughs> a little it's gonna bit. be fun. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I was in Oregon. He has a YouTube channel too. I have two, so. I can link it over here. We're currently making our future website. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna be featured on the EF website and we are working on our story and uh, the pictures, so we'll be able to see that soon. Stay tuned. <laughs> scavenger hunt that they put up for us so we're gonna walk around the whole town of Surrey right now and we're excited is it the choices that you've left tripping in regret check the mirror's reflection but don't recognize yourself with every verse you present it's so far and we're supposed to eat this Swiss dinner. I'm curious. We're gonna see what it's like. A lot of cheese. It looks cute though. Yeah. This is so nice. But EF is like paying, like paying for everything. So we're fine. So nice. <laughs> we're so grateful. The dinner was all right. It was more like an appetizer though. Yeah. Because we only got cheese, um, <laughs> bread, and potatoes. Tomorrow, have to miss her again. But we're gonna visit each other. Like yeah. She's gonna come to the Netherlands. Netherlands, and she's gonna go to Sweden. So we're gonna go home and get some well-needed sleep. And we'll yeah. talk to you guys tomorrow. Yeah. But I think yeah. it's like it's Slavery, retired again. The chocolate is so great. The, the cheese is great times friends. two. It's rainy and I love Switzerland. We're on our way to the office to get some breakfast and then I'm leaving at like ten. So that's not allowed. Stay. It's been such lovely like two and a half couple of days I'm so happy that I went and that I got the opportunity to even go on this trip like I'm so grateful for everything that EF has done for us and for everyone that I met I was really not expecting it to be this fun it's just such a cool thing to be a part of this lovely like EF family to get to connect with people from all around the world and to just get to talk about exchange years again because obviously people from back here can't really relate in the same way and they're also pretty tired I think of hearing about my exchange story all over again so to meet people that have been through exactly what you've been through is just so refreshing yeah it's just crazy how I've made such deep connections kind of already in just like two days but i think it's because as i said it's just so easy for us to relate so there's never like an awkward moment like there's always something to talk about everyone that is an exchange year too i feel like are typically more social and outgoing and just 
lovely people that love to have fun and just open up themselves more easily so yeah i really have excuses to go and visit like all of europe now i'm really just excited to see where my ef journey takes me in the future because this is obviously just the beginning and there's so much more that you can grow within this community it's just so nice to stay within this community too because it feels as if my exchange story gets to live on i just love being an ambassador because i get to meet people that have been through the same things as i said and also meet new people that are going on exchanges and as you guys know i love giving my advice and just seeing their excitement to go through something that i've been through there's just something so special about that just to be able to inspire other people to do something that will potentially change their lives because exchange years really do change lives so yeah hello everyone so i am now on my way to my 12 hour work shift is this even allowed like i am seriously curious because i do not know how i'm gonna survive this like i love my job and i love working there but i am so tired today from this weekend and working at this job too totally drains my social battery like the amount of people that i meet at my work is actually insane i would say that i've gotten so much more extroverted in the last couple of years but i am still introverted <laughs> deep inside and i need my alone time sometimes to like charge up my social battery and i haven't had that for the past like three days which makes me so tired and now having to work a 12 hour shift at the most socially draining job on top of this oh my god gonna get that much hours of sleep even though i could literally sleep for like a week i literally don't even understand how the things that happened this monday still was this week like it feels like ages ago because so much has happened since this was my last shift at the amusement park for the season so it'll be like three weeks into my next shift which is so so nice i could not even tell you how much i need that right now because i really just need time to focus more on my school work and on my youtube channel because i haven't uploaded in such a long time which i'm so so sad about like i literally love making videos for you guys the most so i'm so sorry that it's been slacking with everything else that's been going on but i just want to thank you so much for being here watching till the end i love you guys a lot and i'll see you guys in my next video